start with was or where was or where okay you're gonna start with was or where and then the object and then the boss participle so was this room cleaned yesterday and don't forget the question mark okay Okay, the form of passive subject plus verb to be plus post participle. For example, a letter was written. A letter was written. I don't know who wrote the letter. Okay, when writing active sentences in passive voice, note the following. The object of the active sentence becomes the subject of the passive sentence. The object of the active sentence becomes the subject of the passive sentence. And you're gonna start the sentence with the object. The form of the verb is changed to verb to be, either in the present or the past, plus past participle. Okay? The subject of the active sentence becomes the object of the evasive sentence, or you drop it. We said that we're going to start the sentence with the object of the active sentence. Okay. The subject of the active sentence will become the object of the passive. Okay. Now, we have the tense the subject, the verb, the object. I want you to divide the sentence into these three main parts, subject, verb, object, to make it easier for you to answer the questions. So the tense. We have the present simple passive and we have the past simple passive. And we have the active sentence and the passive sentence. So let's start with the present simple passive, the active sentence. Rita, Rita writes a letter. Rita writes a letter. Rita is a subject, writes is the verb, a letter is the object. Now I want to change this sentence into passive voice. So we're going to start with the yes object so we're gonna start with the letter and then we're gonna change the verb a letter is plus plus participle written is written by rita okay so easy past simple passive the sentence is rita wrote a letter the verb write is in the post Rita wrote a letter. Where is the object? A letter. Very good. A letter was, plus post participle, written by who? By Rita. A letter was written by Rita. Okay, I hope you understand.